Soccer 9H Frank Gunn, APFC Dallas midfielder Jacory Hayes, right, falls to the turf over Toronto FC's Ryan Teller during first half MLS soccer game action in Toronto, Friday, May 25, 2018. Frank Gunn, the Canadian Press via AP, by Dan Crook and Armin Coffey It's been a busy week with two games for the first team, and the fringe players getting a good run out in a 5-1 win. Over at Tigres UANL11, let us know what you think on social media or in the comments. Starting XI1 Mauro Diaz, Mauro pulled the strings on Wednesday, continuing his great stretch of games. Playing as a false winger, he had two assists and looked engaged throughout, until he was subbed off. High, 1, low, 112 Reggie Cannon, anytime someone highlights something Reggie isn't doing right, he almost immediately corrects it. He wasn't getting up the field enough then he excels and scores. He went to ground at the wrong times, then he's timing challenges like Tony Adams in his prime. It's scandalous that he's not on the MLS All-Star ballot. Hi, 2, low, 8 Steve Ham, special contributor FC Dallas midfielder Kellen Acosta, 23, lets out a yell following his goal in the 19th minute of play against New York City FC. The two MLS teams played their game at Toyota Stadium in Frisco on May 14, 2017. Steve Ham, special contributor, 3 Kellen Acosta, 6, Kellen is looking like his box-to-box -box old ways, threatening on the attack and almost grabbing a goal against the Galaxy. He had the shot that Aruti deflected in against Toronto and is connecting the team transitioning from defense to attack. High, 3, low, 194 Maxi Aruti, 1, Maxi tormented the club that brought him to MLS, but sat out in LA with his minutes being managed. He largely worked on fitness with Santiago Mosquera at practice between the two games. High, 4, low, 85 Reto Ziegler, 3, Reto was suspended for the Toronto game but provided stability in the back even during the heaps of pressure the Galaxy unloaded. High, 4, low, 96 Matt Hedges, gave up some needless fouls on Giovinco, which resulted in a PK and that opening minute free kick that should have put FC Dallas down by 2. With Minor's tendency to drift wide, the captain was a missed presence in LA and will certainly be back this weekend. High, 2, low, 6, 7, Ryan Hollingshead, 7, player of the match for the Galaxy match, contributing a goal, assist, and goal line clearance. Hollingshead will always have a role to play with his flexibility. High, 7, low, 198, Jimmy Maurer, minus 4, Maurer's assets are his distribution, calmness, and communication. These are things that Gonzalez lacks that contributed to going from cruising at 3-0 to, to desperately clinging on to the lead. Don't be shocked to see Jimmy back between the sticks on Saturday. High, 1, low, 89 Jesse Gonzalez, 4, 9 saves against Toronto and Jesse was looking like the starter we expected him to be. Then the Galaxy game came and he looked as shaky as ever with his communication and distribution issues. Jesse may get stuck with the start in San Antonio as a result. High, 9, low, 2010 Santiago Mosquera, minus 3, an OK game in Toronto and a substitute appearance in LA. The team is managing his reps in practice, so maybe the World Cup break will help us see more of the breakthrough version of Santi. Hi, 5, low, 14-11 Carlos Gruezo, 1, scored the game winner against LA and has done well in the three midfield formations. Hi, 10, low, 14 the bench Stuart F. House, special contributor FC Dallas defender Minor Figueroa, 31, takes a shot on goal during the second half as FC Dallas hosted Real Salt Lake at Toyota Stadium in Frisco on Saturday, March 3, 2018.
Stuart F. House, special contributor, 12 minor Figueroa, 5, a pair of decent outings for the Honduran. As Buzz mentioned, his tendency to act as a left back while playing in the middle could do harm. That's making me miss Matty Hedges. High, 12, low, 1913 Jacory Hayes, minus 3, it's not due to play he falls but the play of others. Jacory is a fine player and is going to be needed with the match congestion that Dallas is feeling right now. High, 1, low, 13, 14 Roland Lama, minus 3, reduced to a sub roll this past week. It'll be interesting to see where he stands with the team at home on Saturday. Hi, 6, low, 14, 15 Christian Coleman, 1, he scored. He also got sent off, high, 10, low, 16, 16 Michael Barrios, minus 1, Mikey is just off the boil. He looked incredibly dangerous in Toronto, the Diablito that we knew and loved in 2016, and you can kind of say he had an assist as Gruezo finished up his save lob for the third against LA. He's just looked wasteful for a while though. Hi, 10, low, 16, 17 Victor Uloa, 1, Victor is one of those players that Oscar can rely on week in and week out but his play is not that noticeable because he does the dirty work. Hi, 12, low, 1818 Jordan Cano, 3, if the Galaxy game went a little differently, Cano would have likely made his debut. Practices for the LA game involved Cano coming in for Ziggler, but the team needed the experienced Swiss in the face of his Zlatan-shaped onslaught. Hi, 18, low, 23 reserves 19 Brandon Servania. Servania went 90 minutes against OKC in USL and got some playing time in the friendly against Tigres. Hi, 19, low, 23 Stuart F. House special contributor FC Dallas forward Tesho Akindel, 13, uses his body to stop the ball during the second half as FC Dallas hosted Houston Dynamo at Toyota Stadium in Frisco on Wednesday, August 23, 2017. Stuart F. House, special contributor, 20 Tesho Akindel, 2, 2 games this week and 2 spent on the bench with Michael Barrios and Santi Mosquera preferred as second strikers. Hi, 15, low, 2,221 Paxton Pomichol, minus 1, he is slowly getting into rhythm and back into the rotation. He was man of the match against Tigres at the 10 spot. This is where having a USL team would really help Dallas. Hi, 20, low, 2,522 Jesus Ferreira won, 3 7 minutes on the wing for Tulsa in the Black Gold Derby followed by 70 up top against Tigres. Jesus needs minutes like that consistently. Hi, 22, low, 2,523 Brian Reynolds won, Reynolds is still working on transitioning to right back. Don't expect him to get playing time with the first team just yet but he looked good going forward against Tigres. Hi, 23, low, 2624 Anton Nedjilkov minus 21, the Bulgarian butcher, Barbarian is out for 6 to 8 weeks with a broken collarbone. Hi, 3, low, 2425 Chris Reeves, injury recovery for Reeves. Hi, 18, low, 2,526 Kyle Zobeck. Kyle will only see the bench in next week's USOC game but he gave a good account of himself against a Tigres UANL reserve team on Memorial Day. Hi, 24, low, 26 that's another week in the books. Ryan Hollings head makes the biggest jump of the season, leaping 7 spots with his goal, assist and goal line clearance in LA. Ned Yilkov takes a record tumble due to injury as last week's number 3 faces 6 to 8 weeks on the sidelines. Has Jesse done enough to stay in the starting roller? Will Jimmy be back in the net on Saturday? Let us know what you think, third degree.